Welcome to this tutorial on doing critical note taking brought to you by Reading University's study advice team. It is designed for you to go through at your own pace and you can pause it at any time. Note taking is at the heart of academic study but it is a skill that needs to be developed. We can all recall a time when we've had so many notes for an assignment we don't know what to do with them or found that note taking was taking too much time leaving us little time to write the assignment. Or perhaps worse still, when we come to write the assignment, we realise our notes don't contain the information that we need. This tutorial covers some key principles to taking notes to help with some of these problems. It includes careful consideration of the purpose for which you need notes and the need to be selective. The need to take an organised approach to note taking and finally the need to record your own thoughts as you're taking the notes. We take notes for different purposes but in general it helps with our understanding as we put ideas into our own words and it helps with memory recall. When it comes to assignments we are generally taking notes for two broad purposes. The first is to help with a general understanding of the topic and the second to record specific information to support an argument. Either way, it helps us to think of some questions that you're looking to answer beforehand. Consider the analogy of going shopping for a particular purpose, say a party. Without an idea of what you're searching for, helped often by a list, everything on the shelves could look enticing, useful and relevant. You could be persuaded by all the offers and before you know it, you have a basket full of things you don't need, such as tea bags, baked beans and a pineapple. The same is true of note taking. Without an idea of your purpose, you could end up with irrelevant information and pages of notes that you can't use. You may be taking notes in order to gain a general understanding. This may be as part of your central reading for your course or in the early stages of researching for your assignment. Remember you're just looking for some solid foundations on which to build your assignment, not for specific details. So use skimming and scanning techniques to identify the main themes within your subject, to pull out the main arguments, and use these to help to determine your focus. When taking notes for a specific assignment, you will require more details. Identifying the key arguments within a text and making a note of the supporting evidence are key, as is noting down how this will help you to answer the question you're trying to answer. Keep your main research question at the front of your mind to stop you getting distracted by all the information on offer. Before writing anything, think critically. Do you need this information? What question does it help you to answer? Have you already got something similar? Remember, you don't want to end up with pages and pages of notes all saying the same thing. Notes can take many forms, bullet points, spider diagrams or lists. Just consider what works best for your purpose. You do need to remember to add in bibliographic details and be able to distinguish between your own words and direct quotes, so as to avoid any unintentional plagiarism. Try using different colours or fonts to distinguish your words from those that you've copied directly. You might also want to use a template like this one which ensures that not only do you think about the purpose of your notes, but that you record bibliographic details. Finally, remember that note taking helps to develop your understanding. And as you are taking notes, you will need to develop your thoughts on how you're going to use this information, how it relates to your previous knowledge, and how it might trigger some examples which help you to understand your ideas further. Record all this too within your notes using a different format as it will make more sense to you when you come back to read over your notes later. So in summary, note taking is a skill that we need to develop but follow these four principles of critical note taking and this should help alleviate many of the frustrations we face when writing our own assignments. <laughs>